I am deaf. I am black. I am Jewish. White. Native American. So I am... What? What about my kids? Who are even more mixed than me? I get an email from my son at school. You need to pick a primary race. White, Hispanic, Asian, African American, black. One needs to be chosen. Primary and then a secondary. Primary as in one died is more primary than the other. I'm going to call you and say which one you want to pick. Yeah. We have to put something. You can deny my kid in education because I'm going to pick a primary race. I'm not one or the other. I'm this space in between. Race is not an individual choice in America. It is a social choice. Black, your skin color. It's about race. It's not it's about race. race. They use the term multiracial or biracial to distance themselves from blackness. But who says that I have to stay in that space? There's so many kids who are being born of this next generation that are not a single race. We're not able to say, oh, I'm mixed because you're forcing me to pick a race. Very tempting to just say, let's just forget it. I'm a human being. I think it's fear. I don't think we as a nation are there yet. They want to stay stuck into the norm of what we're used to. What do we want? Justice! Is race really the driving force in America? Mr. Zimmerman was a white Hispanic. You know, if I had a son, he'd look like Trayvon. It's always going to be that average white male, you know? Privileges whiteness at the top of the scale. They have mistaken white supremacy for personal excellence. We've been trained to put someone in a category. My race does not fit into a box. Here we go. So he would be African-American? Absolutely. Hispanic. Let's say white. 